Ranking member, a eh, war finance committee, a woman, a shabby jeffy, council, a two forcing, and now no sooner need any bray, a woman, a shabby jeffy, pa, and what they air to, penny for name, a shabby jeffy, and say, Covenant is a canon study, a man, a banner, the boom, conta, Gana, man, penny, and a drunk, a coup for the son of the orca, after you are so far better to a chessica, some so, or no so bar, or so son of the orca, as a contabuno, or more the acquire broth, can be a banner, or can it yet no call. As a moon shedan now, in the Abaya, and Penifonia, no Amon Pabba, could be no moon shimmy, said the bit me about my gun of whom who said Capre, Sempoa, and a BD, a mansem. Of accountability. It is our hope that the minister responsible for finance will be working with other sector ministers in appearing before the Committee of Finance and Health as directed by the speaker today. We say this because the statement as delivered by the minister responsible for finance lacks detail and full disclosure. And most importantly, does not account for the entire amount that they have spent. Let me draw your attention to the fact that this statement failed to account for the amount that they have received on the back of the COVID-19 trust fund which is also a public fund. As we speak, no Ghanaian knows exact amount that they have received and how much they have spent and how much is actually left in the account. We think it is, only this, it is only through this forum that we can provide a proper form of accountability. And so I am surprised that the minister responsible for finance failed to give us some, at least, detail of that amount. Forgetting the fact that the trust fund was established by the parliament, in fact, Act 1013, which is called the Novel Coronavirus COVID-19 National Trust Fund Act 2020, established the so-called the COVID-19 Trust Fund. And so it should be accounted by the minister responsible for finance. And every single penny of that amount is a public money and should be accounted for. Year 2021, when schools were supposed to be reopened, the second cycle schools, the secondary schools, they had to spend 100 million US dollars, at the time, city equivalent of 598 million dollars, million cities, to buy for hand sanitizers and nose masks alone. 598 million Ghana cities to buy for hand sanitizers. I mean, what sort of sanitizers is this? I mean, what sort? Did they buy a river of hand sanitizers? or uh, a, a warehouse full of uh, what you call it no smacks it is difficult to comprehend and that is why we still believe that the minister must come again and account for this in detail